Hey guys, today I'm going to be reacting to the Pokemon Direct that is released on June 6, 2017. Um, it was released uh, just a little bit ago. Um, I, I believe the live stream is still going on. I, I'm not 100% sure. I think it's still going on right now. But what I did is I went back to right before the live stream started. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch the whole Pokemon Direct. Um, the reason why I'm watching just the Pokemon Direct and I'm watching it right, right when it's released while it's still live is because most likely what they're going to do is if there is a new Pokemon game released or announced in this, um... Pokemon Direct, they're most likely going to like release like a separate video and it's going to show the Pokemon game and all that stuff. So I'm going to be spoiled. You get me? If if I'm going to get spoiled by the title of that video if there is a new game releasing. So what I wanted to do is just react to the whole entire Direct kind of blindly, not knowing if there is going to be a new Pokemon game. For example, Pokemon Stars announced in this Direct. So when it is announced, I'm going to be really, really surprised, even though... I am already kind of like expecting a game to come out because it is a Pokemon Direct and they're not going to like have a major Pokemon Direct unless there is a new like something new coming out. They're not going to just release a Pokemon Direct just for Pokemon Go or like an update for Pokemon Go or something around those lines. They'll just make some random video for that. So most likely something big is going to be announced. I don't know what it is. Most likely it's a game. I don't know what game it is. Um... But I kind of want to go into blind, so that's why I'm, rather than waiting until, like, a, a separate video comes out, I'm watching the whole entire Pokemon Direct. Anyways, I'm going to stop wasting you guys' time, let's just dive in with this Direct. I believe I brought it back up to, a, like, until, like, it's right before it began. So, it should begin in a little bit. Okay, yeah, now it's beginning. Okay, let me turn it up. <clears throat> hey, Hello, everyone. I'm Ishihara. Alright, I'm Pokemon kind of excited. Pokemon. Today, I'll be delivering the latest news about Pokemon from our offices. So what's the latest news? Nintendo Switch? As many of you know, Nintendo launched its new system, Nintendo Switch, on March 3rd. You may even be playing some games on your own Nintendo Switch So I'm guessing, already. yeah, Pokemon Stars is going to come out for maybe Pokemon Nintendo, Nintendo Switch. Switch. I think that might now, be what this is. Finally, Pokemon we are excited to announce a Pokemon game for the system. Oh, so our Pokemon is coming out for Nintendo, Nintendo Switch! Switch will be the Pokemon fighting game. Oh, it's Tekken. Pokemon Tournament Deluxe. Oh, Pokemon Tournament. Oh. We've okay. prepared a special trailer to showcase the game. It's not Pokemon Stars, but I'm okay with it. All right, let's see. Let's see what this is. I like Pokemon Tournament, though. Pokemon Tournament is amazing. I love it. But, like, I was hoping, like, Pokemon Stars or some crazy stuff like that. Pokemon Pokemon oh yeah, he brings the switch with him so he can play it portable now. Okay, same old graphics. It hasn't changed much graphically. So it's kind of like um Mario Kart. That came out for the Nintendo Switch. Oh, you can play multiplayer like that. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Oh, I actually like that feature. You know what? Yeah, now I'm digging it. Now I'm digging it that you can do that. Well, death to my Wii U, because the only reason why I had my Wii U is because of my freaking Pokémon Tournament. But now since Pokémon Tournament isn't is coming to the Nintendo Switch, then bye bye Wii U. <laughs> That's literally the only reason why I had my Wii U. So he mains a Charizard. Yo, how does a Charizard beat a Suicune though? So can you verse with two different systems like this? Okay, so yeah. Yo, they have fucking the CGI! But it's the support. They have Yuvatol. Yeah, this Sidui. No, this Sidui is actually a playable character. What is this? So this a uh, Dark Rise is a playable character too. I think we already knew that though. There were some um there were some hints about it. Or some leaks about it. So Dark Rise is a playable character and I think we've seen it's um it's awakening or it's um What is it called? I forgot what it is called. 
you know how I forget what it's called now. When Pokemon Mega Evolve and all that stuff, is it like synergy? I, I, I think it's something to do with synergy. We've seen like a synergy form. Yeah. <laughs> so he came all this way to visit his brother. And what he gave him, uh, uh, I'm guessing those are his nephews. I gotta play Nintendo Switch. So how do you play with the TV mode? Yeah, there's this Decidueye. Yo, I'm happy Decidueye is actually a playable character. Since Decidueye was my Pokemon. There's Pokemon Sun and Moon. Wait, this isn't Pokemon Sun and Moon. This isn't Pokemon Sun and Moon? What is this shit? Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon? I hope you enjoyed that. Pokemon Tournament Deluxe takes full advantage of the variety of gameplay modes. I see what you did. Nintendo Switch. I see what you, you just can, did. Course, your what the fuck? That was shady, Nintendo. Nintendo. Pokemon battles on a larger scale. That was fucking shady. You, want, you can play in tabletop mode. Share one of your Joy-Con so, with another. They have player, a whole trailer. And dive into a match anytime, anywhere. For freaking this Pokemon Tournament that we've already had before. Tournament, players could choose from 16 and then at the Pokemon. end they suddenly show fucking ultra sun and those, ultra moon the nintendo switch version will include dark Darkrai, Darkrai, scissor scissor okay empoleon empoleon and krogunk oh krogunk is a playable as well as decidueye from okay. pokemon sun and pokemon moon for a Any total other? of five new playable Pokemon. That's it? That's it? Okay, okay. So just this Decidueye. I'm happy they got Decidueye. You can enjoy three versus three See, this is where I got confused. This is well where I thought Decidueye might have been like a... And friend-only group matches. We're really like giving a support it character because he had it like on the second match. slot. That's really cool. So it is like uh, Pokemon Tekken Tournament now. Deluxe will launch on September 22nd. So September 22nd. That's so wild out. And now... Starting on June 13th in LA at this year's E3, one of the world's largest gaming conventions, we will have a playable demo for you to enjoy at the show. Oh sweet, now I kind of want to go to E3, but now it's too late. <laughs> We're also planning on including this title on Nintendo Treehouse Live. In addition, the game will be featured in its own full-on invitational tournament at E3 as an on-stage event, oh. which we're live streaming right from the show floor. So please Shit, look forward to it. I gotta watch it. that live stream. Because I want to see like the Decidueye. Pokemon Ultra Moon. Okay, now this is what I wanted. Trailer just a few moments ago. I would like to pass it on to someone who can tell you more about it. Okay, good. So we're getting more information about it. That's good. That's good. I was a little worried. I was like, that's yeah. all you're gonna show? Hello, just everyone. suddenly like I'm show Masuda it? From Game Freak. I'd like to introduce you to the latest installment like, it's not of something the Pokemon we didn't series want. for the Nintendo 3DS family of systems, Pokemon Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon. These games I, at first I was like, wait, taking place this isn't Pokemon Sun and Moon, it's like those flowers? Pokemon Moon, the Pikachu? Featuring Pokemon that didn't appear in the original versions. New features will Look, allow you to enjoy your adventure shit? even more, making this truly an ultra title. And then Mimikyu? I don't Pokemon remember that. Pokemon Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon will see a simultaneous global release on the Nintendo 3DS November family systems on uh, November 17. 17th. Please stay tuned for more information. That's all you're gonna give us? Oh, they're adding fucking my favorite game! They're adding my favorite game to I the 3DS, aren't they? I have one more announcement they? for you. This fall, we'll release Pokemon Gold version yes! and Pokemon Silver version for yes, the I'm buying that right now. on Nintendo 3DS. Those two are my... In case you guys do not know, Pokemon second Gold generation is my favorite Pokemon generation. Pokemon Silver version I love were originally these released these in 1999 shit. as the second installment in the Pokemon series. Oh With the these salt virtual console I'm about releases, to cry. we've recaptured all the fun of those I mean, original yes, there Game Boy Gold Color games, silver out there, and but... both will become compatible with the Pokemon Bank application. We hope you look forward to reliving the excitement all Dude, over oh again. oh my god, I'm gonna cry. The games will launch on the same day as Pokemon Tournament Deluxe, September 20th. So we got something to play before Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon again. Thank you, Mr. Masuda. We'll be hard at work on Pokemon Tournament Deluxe for Nintendo Switch. Pokemon Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon more for Nintendo 3DS about Ultra Sun and, Ultra Moon. and Pokemon Gold version and Pokemon Silver version for the Nintendo 3DS Virtual Console service for all of you Pokemon fans. That's it for today. Is there a website already out there? For Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon? 
I'm guessing there has to be a website already out there. Okay, so I'm guessing that's the end of the direct. Yo, oh my god. I, okay, that was shady. That honestly was really, really shady. Like, they have this whole entire Pokemon tournament trailer, and then they, uh, they, they give, like, the freaking nephews, like, this game, or, like, this, like, little present, and then they open the present, and they're playing on their 3DS, and I'm like, oh, that's just Pokemon Sun and Moon. And then you see it, and you're like, okay, yeah, it's just Pokemon Sun and Moon. Then you see some little subtle differences, and I'm like, oh, wait a minute, I don't remember it being like this, and I don't remember the outfits being like that. And then all of a sudden, they show the Pikachu... Um, which I most likely will have like an image here while, while when I'm when I'm editing and all that stuff. I gotta look that up. I gotta look. I gotta look at it again. Um, hold up, cause like that that like I was like what? Hold up. Oh my god. I can't. I can't find it. No, never mind. But like they showed like the Pikachu's, and then they showed the Lichen Rock as like um, as like um, what is it called? Trial Beast or what? What were they called? I forget what they're called. But they showed um. One of the, 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 what were they called? I can't remember what they're called now off the top of my head. Totem Pokemon. It showed Lycanroc as a totem Pokemon. I couldn't think of it right off the bat, but it showed Lycanroc as a totem Pokemon and they showed Mimikyu as a totem Pokemon. I'm like, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold the freaking phone. I was like, okay, this is not Pokemon Sun and Moon. And then all of a sudden you see Lunala and Soga Leo almost fused with necrozma it's almost like pokemon black and white too it lit actually no i take that back scratch that it is pokemon black and white too it literally they're doing the same exact thing where they fuse the legendaries the, with the third legendary and then they literally just kept the same name but added something to the name it's called ultra sun and ultra moon Black 2 white 2 they're literally doing the same exact shit they did with pokemon black and white I'm guessing there's going to be like a time skip and that's why everything looks different too. So is there actually going to be gyms now? Because there is a time skip and there's going to be an actually like, um, no, well they showed totem Pokemon. So yeah, I'm guessing the trials are still going to be a thing. I don't know. I got to see this. I got to look up the Pokemon website. I'm sorry guys, this video will be longer than I thought it was going to be. But I got to look up the Pokemon website, see if like it's already out and all that stuff. Pokemon... Pokemon, official Pokemon website. Let's see if, like, something's already out by it. I don't think so. I don't think they would have updated the website already by now. Yeah, I don't think so. Let's see. Yeah, they haven't... They, nah, they, nothing's yet. Yeah, nothing was released yet. Nope. Yeah, they still got Pokemon Sun. Alright. Alright, I'm fine. I'm fine with that. Anyways. Um, I haven't been on this website in a while. It's been... It's been actually, like... Almost a year, ever since I started YouTube, um, I haven't been on this website after Pokemon Sun and Moon was already out, done out. Um, I'm having nostalgia right now, and then they're releasing Pokemon Gold and Silver. Oh my god, Pokemon Gold and Silver! Those, in case you guys do not know, I already mentioned this before, but those games were literally my childhood. Like, I love those games. Like, my first game ever was Leaf Green. And then my cousin told me that there was this game that came out for the Game Boy Color. And I'm like, oh, I've never played this. Because I played, I played through, uh, Kanto. And then I played through, um, I played to, um, Hoenn. And then my cousin told me that there was a second game or a second region. I, I never played Red and Blue, um, when I was a child. Because those were, like, super rare when I was a child. Um, but... Um, I played through Leaf Green and Fire Red on, on, uh, those were my first games, and then I played through, uh, Emerald and, uh, Sapphire. So, my cousin told me about that there was another generation, I was like, okay, I want to play it. So then, um, he taught me how to actually get an emulator and a ROM, and I played on the computer. Oh my god, man, I fell in love with those games. Like, even though, like, the graphics were worse, I, I freaking loved those games so much. I would constantly play them. I played them more than Leaf Green. Uh, I played them more than freaking Emerald. Like, I, Emerald was amazing. Don't get me wrong. I loved Emerald, but, like, Gold and Silver, I loved it so much. I don't know why. I think it's just, like, the the way that you could go into two regions, and then after that you fight Red. It's just It was just so amazing for me as a child. Like, I freaking loved it. <laughs> Anyways... Um, I'm happy that they're having that, and then they're, um, they have the, that you can use Pokebank, and you can transfer the Pokemon into Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Um, I cannot wait, man. Yo, the hype is here! 
The hype is here! Oh my god, I cannot wait. Anyways, I most likely will do another video, maybe talking about some more of this stuff. Maybe, like, do a review. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. I don't know. I, 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 it's just, like, it's... I'm still mind blown. I'm still mind blown. Just by the way they, like, suddenly just gave you the game. I'm like, wait, give me a second. I, I It's just, like, the way they just suddenly included the game into the the Pokemon Tournament trailer. I just... I wasn't ready. I just wasn't ready. I wasn't expecting it. <laughs> Anyways. Oh my god. I guess I'm going to end the video with that. Because I, I can't I can't put words together right now. Uh, just give me a few minutes. And I'll probably come back. And I'll do another video where I'm actually calmed down. And I can actually talk about stuff intelligently. <laughs> Anyways. I guess I'm going to end the video with that. If you guys like my reaction, please leave a like. Also subscribe. Check out my other channels in the description box below. Also, follow me on social media where keep you guys up in case anything happens. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.